Hey guys, Paul here. I uh, sent something to a, uh, a group text that I'm a part of a little bit ago. I thought I would then share it to the channel. This is just a thought, something to think about, pray about. Um, I've been asked today about this whole uh, China balloon going over my country. And uh, from what I saw today, I guess there was a total of three balloons that were in our above our country and so forth and then you look at the pattern how it came down through canada from the north kind of across the country but i want to share something here and the key word that i want to share with you is the word myrtle okay m y m y r t l e okay so this thing was shot down i guess the main one was shot down right off the, the beaches of uh, i think south carolina which would have been Myrtle, Myrtle Beach, right? Right close to Myrtle Beach. So, Zechariah chapter 1 and verse 8 says, I saw by night, and behold, a man riding upon a red horse. And he stood among the myrtle trees. C catch the word. Catch the, I'm connecting that word. Um, that were in the bottom. And behold, behind him were their red horses speckled in white. And then if you read Revelation 6, verse 3 and 4, and when he opened the second seal, I heard the second beast say, Come and see. And they and there went out another horse that was red. And power was given to him that sat thereon to take peace from the earth, and that they should kill one another. And there was given to him a great sword. So anyways, just want to share that with you. Interesting connection with the word myrtle um, and, can, and Zechariah chapter 1, verse 8. I don't, I'm not going to go deep into this. I just want to share that. You uh, let the, you pray over these scriptures yourself because um, I haven't got, honestly, I don't have a word from the Lord. So I'm just sharing just what something I've seen earlier and it kind of hit me and I thought, you know, I'll at least give a, a simple uh, sharing of scriptures. You know how this ministry operates? I wait for the Lord. I don't come on here trying to uh, act like I got insight on something unless God gives me a revelation. He speaks to me direct to bring a message to the nation. So last night's message, I encourage you to listen to it because it's, it's titled Powerful. And those who follow this ministry, the prophecy given about the country of the Philippines on January 9th and then what took place in the last couple of weeks, uh, you can't make this stuff up, what God is doing. What God is declaring. So, and then also some things connected to the road of prophecy I share on that message. So, if you get a chance, listen to it. Some updated stuff that I'd seen, and also something that has took place in my country in December, and nobody really knows about it. I share it in that message. You get a chance, listen to it. It's the message uh, that I just, the last one I just released as you after this here. So, uh, God bless you all. And uh, continue to seek the Lord Jesus Christ with all your heart and stay in his word. God bless.